Well, guys, I just got finished watching the Clone Wars new episode, and it's entitled Without a Trace. And this was truly the first Disney Star Wars Clone Wars episode because the Bad Batch arc, that was from the George Lucas era. And I have to say, man, this was a wasted episode. Now, we get to see the return of Ahsoka in this episode. Finally, we get to see kind of what she's going through, which technically we really still don't know what she was going through. She's on a speeder. Her speeder malfunctions. She crashes into this repair shop or whatever, and she meets this this girl named Trace and her sister Rafa. They own this repair shop, and they owe money to this guy and he kind of roughs up Trace and Ahsoka helps her. Another guy comes in with some droids that are kind of bad. And that's really about it. There was nothing to this episode. There was nothing to this episode. I mean, it's called the Clone Wars. And I know that you want to kind of set the tone for what Ahsoka has been doing. But man. You could have came up with something a little bit better than this. We still don't really know where Ahsoka was coming from. And Trace and Rafa. New characters. I don't care about them. I know. It has nothing to do with them being women. Nothing to do with it. It's just that there is no good story. The story is bad. I mean, this is nothing more than a filler episode in my opinion, but I don't think this season can really afford a filler episode because you, it used to be that the Clone Wars used to be 22, 23 episodes and, you know, Disney canceled it and now they threw Dave Filoni a bone and said, all right, we're going to let you complete this final season. So they only gave him 12 episodes. We already got four and now we got a wasted fifth episode. So I don't think they could really afford to have an episode like this. I know there was filler episodes in the other Clone Wars uh, seasons, but like I said, they had like 22 episodes. So now they have wasted. Absolutely wasted an episode on this. There was nothing to it. This may be the worst episode in all of the Clone Wars. It just may be. I'm not saying that the rest of the uh, episodes won't be good, but this one here, since this was Disney's true first Clone Wars episode, it's bad. It's a it's a bad episode. I mean, I'm definitely not going to go back and rewatch this. I mean, it has no rewatchability whatsoever. I still think this could be a pretty good season. I really do, but man. Disney is not starting off on the right foot with this episode. Like I said before, the first four episodes that was made many years ago. That's from pretty much the George Lucas era. But now. It did feel a lot more lighthearted. It felt more like a Disney kid show because we know the Clone Wars, you know, they were getting kind of dark, you know, at the end of. The final season, I mean, the last season anyway. And now the Bad Batch, you can tell that was pretty good. That was kind of getting dark. And now we get this Disney-fied episode. It's, con- it's concerning. It is. I was very, very disappointed with this. And I got done with it. I was like, okay. It, it, didn't, it didn't set up anything for the next episode either. It just kind of ended with, Trace and Ahsoka going back and fixing her bike. It set up nothing for the next episode. We don't know where they're really going. Are we going back to uh, Anakin and Obi-Wan and the Clone Wars? Because really, this had nothing to do with the Clone Wars at all. No clones at all. No Jedi at all. Nothing. It was just a filler episode. And I mean, that's okay if you're going to have a 22 episode arc, but this is just a waste of time. Uh, I would say if you haven't seen the episode and you saw the Bad Batch, 
this is definitely an episode I think you can skip because I don't I just don't see how it's going to tie into any of the other episodes that are coming up. And based on the trailer, it looks like we're going to get intercuts of Revenge of the Sith. And that's what I'm really looking forward to. This one easily had no connections to that whatsoever. Will they bring back Trace and Rafa? Probably. But I'll be happy if they didn't. It's just a waste of time. Just a complete waste of time. Not good. Absolutely not good, guys. But that's just my thoughts on this. What do you guys think of this? Clone Wars Season 7 without a Trace episode. A complete waste of time. I mean, this may have been star wars resistance kind of level but i only saw one episode of resistance because it was awful i hope clone wars gets better it needs to get better because star wars is in a bad place and this was the saving grace of star wars let me know what you guys think about all this in the comments if you're new here to the channel please hit subscribe to catch future videos from me and we will catch you on the next video john matrix out.